Jay Gildas Alexander has taken the NBA by storm this season. Whether it's him hitting incredibly difficult shots or going to the paint and making some crazy layup attempts, Shea is quite literally carrying the Thunder right now. They are in the first seed and he's putting up MVP caliber numbers. So today I thought it would be the perfect opportunity to bring back out the Shea Gilgis Alexander build. This will be the first time you guys are seeing some live gameplay on this build. I have it at a 94 overall and you can see pretty much all of our important stats are maxed out. We've got a high layup, high post control, very high mid range and free throw of course and you can see our playmaking is probably as high as it's ever been on any build. And what I do like about this build defensively is not a liability at 6'6". We have an 85 steal, 71 perimeter and our physicals aren't really anything too crazy but it definitely gets the job done. Now when we take a look at the animations we will be using some new ones that they just added into season 5 like Devin Booker's layup and we will be using his hob jumper. I do have a feeling though just quote me on this on season 6 I think we will be seeing a Shea Gilders Alexander season season six trust me i think that's what's coming but when it comes to the animations we're gonna be using lebron's pass style and pretty much everything else it's kind of common from what i typically do use on builds like this our jump shot's gonna be a tracy mcgrady base with oscar robertson and josh richardson releases we take a look it's 53 47 and the grades are really solid because we have an a plus release speed and an a plus release height real quickly i'll just show you guys all my c tier my b tier my a tier and my s tier badges we have a tunnel hall of fame a lot of gold badges as well so we should be able to do a lot on this build hopefully you guys do enjoy this video like i said this is the first time i really kind of brought some gameplay out on the shea build it's a lot of fun at six foot six it can do a lot if you are new to the channel though make sure to go ahead and subscribe drop a like but let's go ahead and hop right into it for some reason playing rec center at 10 49 doesn't seem like the brightest idea we got some gold plates so maybe our team really isn't that bad yes they have me at point guard this is all i really wanted sometimes i can put a shooting guard and it's not a fun time at all we got a six foot two matchup with a black plate with no affiliation you can see our stats they are decent 22 and 8 we're not shooting the best but you guys gotta remember i do play this build only in the random rank so that's really not that bad but i get the ball to start off here not a good sign when you're the point guard they don't pass you the ball right away but hey we'll see what these guys do i'm not gonna be cutting non-stop Oh, we got a guy that's fading away. I like it. I can't. We'll take it. It would be kind of nice if I could drop like 31 points because I swear every single time I see Shea play, he's dropping 31. And I'm not going to lie to you. He is kind of carrying my fantasy team right now. That's good defense. Dude, there no, there's no way they're calling a foul on that. Like, that was such a bad take. Like, why would they call that? Just bailing him out. Hey, at least he's shooting 44%. Makes a 42. I guarantee I have a 99 free throw. I'm going to miss something this game. See if we can kind of score here. They are leaving us open for our first. We had to get that back, bro. <laughs> you got to give me some redemption on that. Give me some redemption on that, bro. Because there is no way I just airballed a three that early. <laughs> bro, it's got to be like the weirdest like slowdown of all time or something. That's crazy. I don't think I've ever airballed a three that badly before. And how is that going in? Dude, and they give me the turnover on that. These guys, I swear, in the random wreck, I, nine times out of the ten, I'm getting, like, triple teamed. I don't know why. We're going to have to score on our own. Oh, my gosh, 13%. Like, I'm getting, like, tripled and doubled every time I dribble. All right, come on, man. If it comes down to it, I should be able to take my guys to the paint pretty much every single time. I just need my guys to play a little bit of defense. Just stay on their main. Like, defense like that is perfect. I don't know how I don't pick that ball up. It's, like, right in front of my face. Come on, we're here. Come on. Three, two, one. Don't get, don't bail them out. 2K, don't bail them out. At least the, the ball movement's kind of nice. How many times did the ball just swing? If we make that, hey, I like that. The ball just swing like 10 times. Now I got to make sure I'm doing my part in passing the ball too. Let's get our team involved. Let's get our team involved. Go ahead and dunk him. All right, please, please make the three. Please make that. Dude, all right. I just gave this guy an easy layup for running the floor, and that's what he's going to do. That's wild. Ah, uh, the rain. Oh, man, look, I'm making all these contested shots. I kind of have to pick and choose. My guys are kind of like just running all over the floor. They're not really spreading it out that much either. I feel like the paint's getting really just abused down here too. So we got to make sure we're boxing these dudes out. These guys are scoring such late in the shot clock. That's eight seconds left and they're getting open. 
Come on, knock it down, please. Knock it down, please. Come on, wide open. Perfect. Yes, good shot, boy. Come on, man. That's big. I'm going to look for my teammates. I need to get some assists here, too. This is like one of the highest pass accuracy builds I have. So if I'm not getting assists, it's kind of a bad look. Come on, man. Please just start playing defense. I swear these guys, every single time they score, is just such like late in the shot clock. Like right here. That's off, though. I'm here helping. I'm helping. I'm helping. Right back. Right back, please. X, X, X. Come on, need it, need it. Green Bang, Giants. that's a big three with 0.8 on the shot clock. Use our sharpshooting takeover. That's not a bad first quarter. Nine points, one assist, and a rebound. Up by one after the first quarter. That's not bad. For how this started, I felt like we kind of started kind of poorly. I mean, I did air well the three to start it. No, that's off. That's such a bad shot. Yep, we're out of here. Come on. Throw it to my teammate, wide open in the corner. We're going to be a good teammate this video. I'm telling you, I could have went and shot the ball, but like I said, when you're a point guard in the random wreck, you kind of have to do stuff like that. Your team will quit on you so quickly in here. Ooh, why do you jump in that? Don't be jumping, man. That's what I'm talking about. Let's go. Feels like the point guard's kind of out of it. He doesn't want the ball anymore. That's nice. Let's keep playing defense. Oh, see, like, that's what I'm talking about. We're, we can't be letting up easy stuff. Dude, that, that one behind the back is all you need. They play way too high in the rec center. So, like, every single time, that's going to be open. We already have 15 points, too. The point guard, like I said, six foot two coming in here. Probably doesn't have any defense. Doesn't work. You can't do that. Mmm. He greened that, too. That's a contact dunk. All right. Guys should not be scoring this easily. That's another wide open three. Thankfully, he missed. Another. Come on. That's another assist. No, very late. Let's see if we get a little floater off here. That's a little Devin Booker floater. One of the best ones in the game. We might drop a ton of points in this video. Listen, if the point guard doesn't quit, we're going to be going crazy. Nope, we're there. We're helping. Look at the help. 13 and he made it. Yeah, all right. Okay. The fact that this is a six-point game and I have 17 points, it just doesn't make sense. A little scoop. Oh, I tried to do a scoop layup. Why am I getting the pull up in the mid range? Probably not the best time to mess up, bro. Now, now it's a tie game. Why? How is this tied, bro? That's just the random wreck. You could be having a crazy game, and then out of nowhere, they just like let up every single shot. I guess I gotta start passing again. I, like honestly, I don't know how this is tied. Like I feel like we've not missed like pretty much anything, but I guess we're playing no defense. I gotta have to pull up the scoreboard here in a second. I'm guessing it's that guy that's scoring like every single time. Oh, we're, dude, we're hitting so many contested shots right now. That's like at least our third or fourth one. That's that gold dead eye, I guess. And the Hall of Fame mini magician is no joke. This guy right here, that's who it is. And that guy cannot stop that dude in the paint. He's been getting drop stepped all game pretty much. Come on, I'm going to take all my buckets. Like, my guy's not playing defense on me. Somebody else is guarding me, like, the whole entire time. If I'm open in the midcourt, I have to take these shots. I might be I might be being a little bit of a ball hog, but uh, you know what? We're scoring and we're winning, right? Mm, just like that. End of the second. Looks like we're going to be losing. Unless I can get the ball real quick and throw to the shooting guard, please. One more. Yes. In there. Yes, let's go. We do have the lead in the end of halftime. We're going into halftime, which is nice. We're kind of kind of putting on an offensive masterclass. I'm not going to lie to you. Of course, we're player of the half. 21 points, only two assists, which I probably can do a little bit better, but we're shooting 82% from the field. I mean, they really are shooting pretty well. The fact that they're like kind of scoring everything in the paint and there's people just getting wide open for three is not a good combination. No way. There you go. Good shot. Come on. Ooh, knock it down. Dude, that guy, you got to love it. That's the best person in random break. No doubt. The best person that will actually just stand in the corner and spot of the whole entire time. You, you like are the best guy ever. Like you doing that just helps the team so much. He saved that? No way they score off this, right? Look at us helping. And, and we can't get back out. Dude, I, I thought I was going to be able to get back out there. Why, dude, why would he help off the one guy that has sharpshooting takeover and actually spotting up? And I know you guys noticed that dudes were setting double screens. Probably my biggest pet peeve in here. I think I have a new pet peeve every single time I play random rank though. So I don't know. Double screens might be up there. The double screens are definitely high up there in the biggest pet peeves. Look at this guy, bro. He's just a man of everything. Running the fast break, hitting layups, spotting up in the corner. Everything's coming out of the corner for that guy. Oh, I like that. 
like that a lot. A little step back, but Devin Booker step back. I've been using Zach Levine, but since they added Devin Booker's into the game, I knew I had to throw it on. It's kind of clean. Ain't fake. That's off. That's a horrible nope. take. Good. And the guy's playing defense, bro. Oh, one more. Bro, this guy, shout out to this dude. If somehow you're watching the video, you are the MVP. Botting up in the corner and getting out of the way. Look at these guys getting double teamed up the court. Leave me alone. Let me play. Uh, our offense looks so sloppy. When I'm not the one like facilitating the offense, our offense looks so bad. Like that guy just shot a contested shot at the end of the shot clock. Come on, defense, defense, defense. Why the AI shoots everything and that guy was ball watching. He's wide open. Please make it. Look at that. <laughs> Put back layup for Shane. That's what I'm talking about. Doing the little things. Wide open. Come on, knock it down, big fella. Knock it down for me. Oh. Ooh, a little bully action. Oh, no wait, he makes that right. Bro! That guy is knocking down everything. He has 15 on just wide open threes because I've let him up, but I thought I was kind of there on that one. And at that, we're only up by two. I only had four points there, and I scored like every single time I had the ball last time, so that's not a good look. <laughs> we are cooking, man. I'm only trusting my offense right now. I know that's bad, but these guys were missing some easy shots for me. No. Wide open, bro. Come on. That should be good. Oh, that's open. I just missed the quick stop. I can't be doing that. I feel like that's one of the first threes I really missed. That's great defense by that guy, but he turns it right back over. Come on, please make that. No. Dude, are we in danger of losing this game? It's been a one point game for so long. And just like that, we are losing this game. How? There it is. Come on, floater. Floater, float me. Dude, that Devin Booker floater is so, so fast. And these guys have been setting me double screens the whole entire game. I don't know why. I've gone to game chat and told them not to because it doesn't create any any floor spacing, but they're still doing it. That's off. I'm right there, please. Thank you. Finally, I'm getting contest. Dang, this guy does not have any defense down low. Come on. That's an open shot. That should be open. Dang! <laughs> no way we're gonna lose this game, dog. I didn't, I refuse to believe it. Please. Come on, need it, come on. Yes, come on, man. 32 finally making my three-point shot. I didn't even know he really stole the ball there. Why is this game so close? I swear it shouldn't be. Oh my gosh, can we strain together maybe just two more stops? That should be a backcourt violation right there. That's off, that's good defense, he's there. Yes, throw it up, throw it up, throw it up. Come on, fast breaks are our best. No, bro, just pass me the ball. Let me screen. Come on, bro. Look, one stop. Just give me one stop here. I don't know, like, what's going on here. Why they're, like, scoring so easily down there. Honestly, I have to say double team them. That should be three in the key. Yes. Are they? I feel like they barely missed at all. That guy's got 12. That dude's got 20. We're getting killed down low. If we score here and get a stop, we win the game. And I have the ball in my hands. That's good. That should be open. Bat him. Yo. Why did he not swing back up? Bro, I guess that's on me. Is that on me, bro? I swear the guy was standing right there. I thought I was a real person. Hit it. Oh, it's a two. Oh my gosh. Do we have a foul to give? We don't have any fouls to give. Did we just sell this, bro? There's no way I shouldn't have left him open, I guess. But I thought the guy was going to pick up. Seven seconds left on the shot clock. I'm not leaving this guy open again, bro. They're going to have to beat us with a three or something. No, jump. No, we don't have a foul to give. We just lost. Bro, there's no way we just lost this game. He missed. Oh my gosh, he missed. He missed. He missed. He missed. Call the timeout. Please miss this next shot, bro. Please miss this shot. Let's go to overtime. He's got a 60 free throw. Come on, miss. Miss, 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 miss. And he made it, of course. There's no freaking way we just lost that game. I put on an offensive masterclass. 
I mean, I guess I let up wide open standstill threes. But, bro, how do we lose that? There's no way we lost that game. Let's, let's dissect it. 21 points, 12 points. 9 points and 2 points. 13 rebounds, 7 rebounds. Like, dog, there's no way we just lost that. But I couldn't go out like that. I ended up sitting in the main menu for a second and I decided to hop back in. You can see it's 1236 currently. We had a pretty decent team, so we have a good chance of winning this. And what I like the most about this team right here, we had a purple plated center. So as a point guard, that's literally everything you can ask for. But I think I started this game probably as poorly off as possible. End up getting blocked in the first shot. I think I missed a three pointer, but we end up picking up an assist right there. You'll also notice this game, I am playing shooting guard. So you'll You'll see a lot of offense coming from me kind of just creating my own shot off of the catch and shoot off the off the dribble from the corner or something like that you can see my teammate this guy was just running at the rim every single time he flashes it to me in the corner we end up breaking it so i missed my first three shots i was doing live commentary on this so i ended up just stopped doing the live commentary and i was like you know what i'm just gonna finish this game out but it turned out to be a pretty nasty game from us you can see we finally get on the scoreboard we hit that floater we're going the other way hit it with a nice little hesitation wide open top of the key we end up knocking it down so of course right when i stopped recording i started actually playing well because that's how it goes quite literally every single time i record a video you can see we're back into the post now kind of a broken play 31 percent contested post hop shot which is pretty nasty and then they come back this is where it gets bad we had a purple plated center which i thought was going to be good but he was just playing absolutely no defense another nice little dribble pull up right there that was the center's man you'll count how many times this game he was just wide open for three. But again, the point guard was cooking. So with a point guard or somebody can cook, I don't mind spotting up. I don't mind creating my own offense from a corner. Or if I catch the ball like late in the shot clock, I'll be able to create some offense. I don't mind it at all. But this might have been the play of the year. Double alley-oop in random wreck with no communication. Like, do you know how impressive that actually is? It's kind of insane. But you can see now the score is getting a lot closer. It's 31 to 24. And then I think they ended up going on a seven point you know run right here so you can see it's 27 31 we can't score that guy can play zero defense and now the game's tied at 31 so you know what i call a timeout i said let me get the ball real quick let me cook up my guy he can't stay in front of me at all as i crap him wide open three point shot we knock it down to kind of put it into the misery just a little bit kind of stop the bleeding so we go up by three again they're kind of starting to come back and just keeping keeping it close you can see i tried to attack the basket but luckily I've got gold whistle. So we end up getting a foul, making both of our free throws because we had that 99 three pointer and the 99 free throw. And again, it doesn't matter. We get a three point shot, we make a shot. It doesn't matter because these guys are playing no defense, which is just like what happens in random wreck all the time. I don't know. So we're going to halftime. It's tied. They leave me wide open again. Like I said, when we have a good point guard, I don't mind spotting up. But when the point guard's bad, I kind of won the ball almost every single time. Again, you can see, like I said before, try to create my own offense just off a couple dribbles or off the dribble a little bit. Look at this, man. That was probably one of the cleanest shots I've made the whole entire video. The center kind of step up. We hit a nice little dribble pull up. I don't know what happened to my guy. The game was tied. We just walk right into a three-pointer. We have 29 points at this point. Dot the dude across court. He ends up knocking it down. And this is when it started to settle down just a little bit more. I think after this play right here, we hit a floater. And thank goodness for Pro Touch on Hall of Fame. Because I don't know why that was so slow. Usually, Devin Booker is pretty quick. You can see we end up stealing the ball, picking it up. The game is pretty much over at this point. We end up having 30 something, 33 points. So, not too bad to end the video. If you guys are new though make sure to go ahead and drop a like and subscribe and until next time it's been your boy dignified i'm out peace